Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you in ASP.NET how to encrypt and decrypt the connection string in web.config file. See the connection string is totally encrypted. See here my connection string is in plain text now. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. Notice in this web.config file, the connection strings are in the plain text, which contains the add name, my connection, connection string and provider name. Now I want to encrypt this connection string. So for that, click start, all programs, Visual Studio 2015, open that one. And notice the developer command prompt, which is under Visual Studio Tools. Right click the developer command prompt. Open run as an administrator. Click that one. First we need to change the path. I'm adding CD in Windows. Change directory system 32. And now I am adding the command to encrypt the connection string in the web.config file using ASP.NET underscore regiis tool. The command is ASP.NET underscore regiis dot exe to encrypt the keyword is hyphen pef between double quotes connection strings Make sure the S is capital here. After that, I am adding the path of my project. Open Solution Explorer. Right click the web.config file. Properties. The full path. Copy that one. I am pasting here. And make sure delete the web.config page from the path. Enter. And here we got a message succeeded, which means the connection string is encoded. When I minimize this command prompt, see the connection string is totally encrypted. And one more important thing is whenever I rerun the command, the encrypted key values are changed. Again, I'm encrypting the connection string. Enter. It succeeded when I minimize. See? The key values are changed. Now we'll decrypt the connection string. Instead of PEF, just add D here. PDF. And rest of the command is same only. Enter. See here we got the message decrypting configuration section is succeeded. When I minimize, see here my connection string is in plain text now. That's it.